you know, it became where uh, Tip O'Neill was over at the White House a lot more than he had to be. Because they were friends, they would, you know, in advance, you know, try to figure out some kind of compromise and come closer to each other than, than it's going to be my way or the highway. Compromise is what America was built on. And Reagan had a great way of saying it. He would say, just because uh, he disagrees with me about 20% of this issue, that doesn't make him a, that's, he's not a 20% enemy, he's an 80% friend. Mm. And they had a way of, of coming together. I mean, it's emblematic of the way I wish we could be like, yep. and we still can be. Uh, to get back, uh, to working together as Americans. And uh, well said. Well. It's important to note that Ronald Reagan never had both houses of Congress in the Republican camp. So yeah. to pass anything, he had to bring Democrats on board. And right. he and Tip O'Neill would, would duke it out, uh, but at the end of the day, there were major legislative victories that, that required Democrats coming along. Yeah, the, Tip O'Neill was uh, also, besides Nancy, the first person to visit him in the hospital. 